Hey there, YouTube. Welcome to a tutorial that I'm gonna that I'm gonna do, which is um I'm doing a tutorial on how to make a plot for when somebody buys it, they can build in it only in that specific plot, and they buy it with in-game money. Now, plugins you're gonna need is iconomy, which is the money a money per, a money plugin. You're gonna need I think Vault. You're, and you're also you're gonna need world edit, world guard, and simple regions market um, for this one. Now, what you're gonna have to start to do is you're just just gonna need a wand, world edit wand, and then a sign. And what you're gonna want to do is make your plot. So I'm gonna make mine ten by ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Set brick. Now you don't have to set it to brick. You can set it to whatever you want and you don't have to do the design that I'm doing. This is just to show it. Set cobble. And then you're going to want to select the one corner, the first corner, go to the other corner, um, select that as the second position, and type in slash slash expand vert. Now what's that? that's going to do is make it so that the region is all the way up to the top and all the way up to the bedrock. Now, if you don't want to do this, you don't have to. You can just do expand. I think it's like five up. That'll make it. That'll make every single block five up. And slash day. But I'm gonna do it so that it's such as expand vert, which expands it top to bottom. Now, now, um, with that region already selected, you can just do slash rg define and name it whatever you want and but uh I'm just gonna name mine plot one and now um you're gonna wanna do slash okay now I'm just gonna get string out you're gonna want um to figure out what region this region is in you're gonna want it in another region unless you want them to be able to break bro blocks around it because if it's not in a region then they can just break everything around it and not inside it but just around it but mine's already in a region so you want to check if it's in a region mine's in spawn town you don't have to name your spawn town but you want to make sure that this region you can't build in you see it says can you build no which is slash rg um flag region name and then build deny so that's how you do that. Um, you're gonna wanna do slash rg set parent whatever the f that p the plot's name is region name and then whatever region it's in's name and that sets it parent which basically just says that it is smaller than spawn town. It's inside spawn town because if, if the parent was if plot one was the parent of spawn town then I'm pretty sure it would get messed up because it's obviously not in that plot it's well yeah so now you want to do one more thing before we get the sign up you want to do slash rg set priority plot one or whatever you named it one if you don't do that and they buy the plot because this spawn town is has build denied this will also have build denied because it's the parent of it but if you set that to the priority, that means that this area, if it has build true after somebody buys it, then it'll let them build in it, but not out here. Now, nobody can build in this area, now, unless you're an op. Nobody can build in that area or this area. But if you place a sign here that says you can do sell, which keeps it to them forever, or rent, which is what I'm going to do, which only keeps it for as many days that you uh, define. Now, you're going to want to put the plot name here, which I named it plot1, and then go down another space. This is how much money it'll cost. Do not put a dollar sign. I'm just going to say one, just because it's test, so one dollar, for however many days, and I'm just going to say 14 days, or er, I'm going to say uh, one minute. And now, it'll say for rent, plot1, one dollar for one minute and um... I'm gonna de-op myself hold on 
trying to get into the server panel. Okay, hold on. Oh wait. Okay. Um, Diop Dread Mine. I can just do it from here. Okay. Now buy it. And now it's mine. I can't build out there. And I can build in there. Because I bought it. So, um, I'll show you how it works after this minute is up. So, um, so yeah, that, this is my full server. I'm still working on it so that I'm, I'm, I know how to do the plots already. I thought I might as well just explain it to on a, to you guys on a video, just how I do it. This is how everybody, I'm pretty sure everybody does that unless they have different plugins. This is the plugins I use. They're really easy to use. So I'm gonna wait for this minute to be up. Um, so yes. Oh, I thought that was a fine thing. Okay. Um. Whew. So once the m once the time is up. That means less than one minute. Once the time is up, then it should take you off of it. It should go back to saying for rent, one dollar, one minute, plot one. And then you won't be able to build in there anymore. I'm still de opt I'm just in game mode one. Just wait for that to be done. And you don't, um, yeah, never mind. I'm gonna have a skip button to when the minute is up. Okay, well there it is. Um, there's the. Okay, now it's back there, and I can't break in it anymore. So basically, you're gonna want to warn your players that once their time is up, they're gonna want to get all their stuff out of there before their time is completely up because they won't be able to open any chests in here, and they won't be able to open. Um, they won't be able to open chests, build anything, or do anything with it anymore, so they're going to want to get their stuff out of there, because all their stuff will be up for grabs for the next person who buys it. So, thanks for watching. Um, subscribe, rate, comment if you like my other stuff. I'll have the, some links in the description about where to get these plugins that you're going to need, and um, see you next time.